Hey yo everyone, welcome back to another Terraria video, but not just any Terraria video. We're doing Underhaul Part 2, which if you guys haven't seen the first video of the Underhaul mod, I recommend you go check it out. It is a pretty interesting mod, to say the least. Uh, and as you can see, for some reason, we got some birds flying around me. I don't, I'm assuming this is a part of Underhaul's shenanigans. They're not attacking me, and I'm not in God mode. We should probably enable God mode, just in case they do get a, a little ravenous. But yeah, we're gonna go over all the new features that they added in since the last time i played and from what i know there's a good bit starting with the stack limit which has been raised from 20 i believe to something else let's see what the new number is let's see what the new uh I'm assuming that that's a new feature. The squirrels popping out of the trees. It seems like the number is obviously way bigger than what it was before. Maybe they, he just took off the stack limit in general. That or I might have... What in the fuck? <laughs> that or I might just have my max stack plus mod on. That obviously can be a thing. As you can see, I got a lot of things uh, turned off here. You know, just keep in my inventory because I'm using the same character. I don't want to be near that slime. I do not like that noise. But yeah, let's go ahead. Let me go down the list and try and point out new things that I see on the change log slash features list. Starting with the one that I see multiple times on the change log is Clarence has been deleted. Now, the only Clarence that I know of is the one that's going to pop up on the screen. They deleted him? I, I didn't know he was in this. All right, so the next feature after that is boulders now home in on the player and go through tiles. Very interesting, as if boulders weren't already dangerous enough. We're going to take a boulder here. I guess uh, turn off God mode. Uh, maybe we should keep it on and just see you know, how dangerous these things actually are. So obviously, if we hit a boulder with a pickaxe, uh whoa <laughs> that thing kind of quick we can stand over here and uh, we can you know gauge it a little bit more, see how fast and how it homes. Whoa, whoa, yeah, this thing uh, it's a little little dangerous. You know, if there's a feature and there's a lot of features that aren't the greatest in underhaul, uh, it's definitely the jumping, flipping you upside down. I feel like even if you want to do like, you know, a little fun playthrough with overhaul, this, this feature sucks. Like you can't even, you can't even move. Yeah, now that God mode is disabled, let's go ahead and see how dangerous this boulder is. I'm going to try my best to not get hit by it. It's like a little, little uh, challenge here, a little mini game. Maybe I should break a bunch and see what happens. There's no way this thing's going to hit me. What happens if I land? <gasps> Okay, it, it homed in on me after I hit the floor, but you know, I, I made it easy. When is if we do like a bunch of boulders at once? I, is this how boulders work? So if I if I hit, oh, <laughs> oh god, oh my god, this is oh my god, it turned into a bullet hell real quick. I hope I don't get hit by the boulders when they. Oh my. God. I don't know what just happened. Y'all ever play uh, Binding of Isaac and then you get the, the planet item that makes your tears circle around you? I got, I'm getting some uh, Isaac vibes from this. All right, we are moving on to the next features here. Apparently bunnies insta-give you when killed. So let's go ahead, let's put it to the test. They don't insta-give me because I'm in God mode. Let, let's try it again, this time with God mode off and uh, let's just see how insta this gib is. Yep, that's... That's pretty instant. So yeah, it says that birds are now astronomically annoying due to having bad AI. They do not do damage though. They don't do contact damage. They're just, they just fly around you, which can actually be pretty cool. It'd be very, very interesting having just a flock of birds following you around, but I can see how it gets annoying. And also it says that golden birds attract a swarm of regular birds wherever they go. All right, let, let's see. Oh, that's what they meant. I thought what they meant was the golden bird was gonna fly on its own and then the rest of the birds are gonna follow. Okay, interesting. Now at least we got some diversity. All right, so. The next feature we kind of saw already on accident it's the squirrel one it says squirrels now occasionally explode from treetops when they're chopped down it is truly a wondrous spectacle i don't know if i would use wondrous to describe it but boom there we go a whole lot of squirrels i mean at least they're not hostile we aren't in god mode yeah they're not attacking me so that you know that's that's a good thing the next one is worms now exponentially reproduce like cells okay uh <laughs> let's go ahead let's break some rocks and let's let's see this in action break a bigger rock there we go oh oh yeah i'm i'm seeing some reproduction for sure that's a whole lot of worms is it they must have maxed out already let's uh let's go ahead let's just start chopping through them and see you know if we get a banner i don't think worms drop banners i think they're reproducing as i'm killing them that's not good all right the next one is a lot of actions now cause senior pillow-esque noises to play don't know who that is some of which are directly ripped from pillows videos and other which were recorded by yours truly i'm assuming what that means is kind of like the the taking damage noise and everything like when that slime hit me this noise right here 
And also, uh, you know, when the guy died, he made a very interesting noise. <laughs> Moving on to the next feature is B-Nades now shit out hungries. That is a direct quote from Team Mod Loader description of the mod. So let's go ahead. Let's see it. Let's see it in action. I'm going to throw it at these uh, worms. Hopefully it kills them. Okay. <laughs> let's uh, try it again. Not throwing it into the worms this time. Yeah. It did do exactly that. So does it not do it upon direct contact? Maybe if I throw it like right here, it'll explode and hit all the worms. No, okay, not that cool. And uh, you know, last but not least on this features list from what I can see, uh, we kind of went over this feature already, but I feel like we should probably go over it again just because. It is a very, very interesting and unique feature, in my opinion. Let me just make sure that, uh, you know, God mode is on. And uh, I'm pretty sure this is everybody's favorite feature. This is what everyone came to see. I'm going to turn my headphones down. All right, we should be good. Well, I should be good. I don't know about you guys. But once we get deep enough here, any second now, any second now, we're pretty deep into the dungeon. This is kind of anticlimactic. You know what? I'll just summon them in myself. Now, for real this time, what we've all been waiting for. <laughs> Right, I will be honest, the Dungeon Guardian theme is not as good as I remember it. You know, I don't know if they changed it or what, but I, I think I missed the Sans part, the Screaming Sans part more. I don't know, maybe we just got bad RNG and he just kept on playing the same music over and over again. But now, to finish off the video, we're going to be entering Hall Mode, which if you don't know what Hall Mode is, Hall Mode is what happens when you combine Overhaul and Underhaul in the same world. The game implodes upon itself, leaving nothing but a buggy, glitchy mess where the game once stood it's truly a breathtaking moment seeing it in action one which i implore you to experience yourself if you haven't already and are curious warning this special mode has a small chance to corrupt worlds i do advise you to create a new world for this or create a backup as you will not be able to get your existing world back otherwise so it sounds pretty dangerous and uh, you know i always get comments on videos that aren't even the underhaul video they just tell me to combine these two mods and uh, you know i think the game's just gonna crash or something like that but at the same time i feel like maybe it won't crash and some straight chaos is gonna happen whatever let's hop into it i don't know why there isn't music at the menu screen it just kind of vanished when i reloaded the mods all right we are entering the world with hall mode oh we're getting our music back we're getting our music back our, our character hitting that little that little michael jackson little hitting that little michael jackson lean on him kind of not really i may be stretching a little bit but first off i can definitely tell this what is whoa 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 whoa, whoa. <laughs> could definitely tell that there's some chaos going on you know this is already more than i expected i expected it to just crash why is this slime chasing me down like this i don't you want to battle bro i'll get you with this i haven't played overhaul in a minute so i don't know am i getting them there's more slimes i can't i can't be fighting all these guys at once but yeah from what i noticed nothing uh too chaotic uh, I've noticed the world slowly deteriorates when I put my mouse over it. As you can see, blocks just kind of start spreading apart. But, uh, you know, it's not as chaotic as I thought. But maybe we got to sit here a little bit and see what else happens. I got to get away from these slimes, though. These slimes, they, they're they not they're not playing around. Maybe I should enter god mode and see if that, if that does anything. I feel like that'll break the game even more, honestly. Okay, I'm noticing that there's a f floating spider. I don't think they do that. Well, I guess the slimes don't really do that either. But we're in god mode, so I'm not too worried about anything. You know, I haven't played Overhaul in a minute, but these remixes they got for the Terraria music are bumping, bro. 
Oh shoot, what the hell is going on here? Is he trying to attack me? Is he, he trying to fight me? Or is he just floating around? Let me get out of Godman. Let me see if he's trying to fight. Now he's just kind of floating around. It's uh, very interesting. What in the... <laughs> Where did that bunny just come from? Um, I'm hearing some noise. What the hell? Uh, I don't know what's going on. If I did something I wasn't supposed to, I died to fall damage. Of course, out of all the things that could kill me, I died to fall damage. What the fuck is going on? What to where your bosses is? That's 1.4? We might have just saw some 1.4 content. But yeah, as you can see, the longer you stay here and uh, just sit and do nothing, more and more chaos will happen. Uh, <laughs> I can't, I couldn't leave the world. Oh God, the frame rate just <laughs> What is going on? I need to get out of here, bro. I need to get out of this world. Okay, we are at the menu screen. It is nice and peaceful. I can do an outro to the video, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. You know, shout out to Turquoise, the creator of the mod. It's a very interesting mod to say the least, but you know, if Smash Bros Ultimate can get sands, I feel like this mod needs more sands. And I'm not just talking about someone saying the word sands. I'm talking about real sands. But yeah, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like and sub if you guys enjoyed the content. And also make sure to follow my Twitch, follow my Twitter, join my Discord, and check out my second YouTube channel where I post my full Twitch live streams on. I will see y'all next time. I love you guys. Sans.